a bit, uh, you could say, neglected uh, from this side of the country. Um, but they were outstanding today. They had a poor start, and uh, Newcastle really looked good for that first 15 minutes. But uh, after that, it was pretty much all Perth. And yes, the Nigel Bogart send-off didn't help, but that didn't stop uh, you know, the likes of Castro, Harold, um, playing some superb football. If you look at the opportunities that Perth had after they went 1-0 down, I mean, they were just all over the Jets and, and really strolling into the box. And then you've got situations like this, um, where you've got Castro in a 1v1 situation, um, then, then you're asking for trouble. And, and that's been the problem with the Jets this season, the fact that just way too many times they sit deep and they more or less uh, are banking on the opponent or relying on the opponent to, uh, to be inept in the box. And, and this was a, a case of Perth really showing their quality. Um, and we saw as well with that uh, red card decision, the, the second yellow card, um, Bogard was extremely lucky to get away with that Original. first one where yeah. he should have gone. It would have been a one-on-one -on -one situation. But, and, and silly in the end, knowing that he's on a yellow card to go in like that. But, uh, I mean, like you said, Boz, it's really disappointing for the fans. And, and I think the fact that the Jets did so, uh, so poorly last season, um, I think that's been used as an excuse many times this season, basically saying, well, we're not as bad as we were last season. And they were today. Well, the yeah, catch exactly. cry from Scott Miller at the start of the season was, we're going to make it hard.